All right. Well, I wanted to talk a little bit about YouTube. Um, I just put up a video a little while ago, and uh, basically what we got here is my YouTube channel. Um, uh, it was probably, let's see, um, ch -ch 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 -ch. 2010, May 18th, 2010, so a couple years ago or so, I joined YouTube, um, and basically what had happened is my story behind it all is that I... I um I started getting back into model model building and I you know searched out some model vid videos online and um lo and behold what did I find? I found this guy, uh Model Man Tom. Um I see a lot of Model Man Tom's videos, so I start watching this page and that's it, I'm hooked, you know. I you know, I'm full on back into modeling and uh, I used to build them when I was a kid and and I hadn't really built them since and you know this guy was doing all kinds of stuff that I you know and he had tons of videos and I'm watching and I'm you know learning and and then uh, you know so then I I wanted to I wanted to put up my own page so I I developed you know model creations and YouTube page and started posting some videos and in the beginning I, they were pretty raw I was recording on a not a very good camera. Uh, it was pretty much a handheld camera to do uh, pictures with and uh, you know from there I, I did some videos, I did some early builds uh, where I you know um, I featured a couple of different models that I built and uh, uh, from there I, I, I moved on to I got a different camera and we did some other builds. Uh, I did my Enterprise which I was pretty proud of, the 1-1000 Enterprise. It came out pretty decent, you know not Probably not top quality, but uh, for me it was pretty good. I did the uh, F-14 Tomcat that came out pretty good. That was probably my bigger build to, to date. It took me the longest, only because I picked away at it for so very long. Um, that's kind of my run with YouTube. I mean, from there, I just, I, I, uh, I like, my, my page has always been about um, featuring my model builds. Uh, you know, not really information if I can give it to you, but more of a, uh, a feature channel of, uh, kind of my progress and my overall completions of my builds. Um, if there's any information that I can pass along and, uh, or I feel that's necessary or that I learn that I think I can pass along, um, or, you know, that I feel pertinent, per <laughs> I, uh, I try to put that up there, um. That's pretty much the story of uh, model creations and my page. Um, but um, recently, I noticed here on YouTube, if we uh, scroll up, um, all channels will be updated to the new design on March seventh, two thousand twelve. So coming up in a little while, YouTube's going to change into the uh, the new format that a lot of people have uh, already changed to. Um, I've seen the new format. I don't hate it. Uh, one thing I did notice that. I haven't changed yet, so I don't know, is I have all these uh, other channels, which I use for um, finding all um, these guys online. And what I'm really afraid of is, is that I'm going to lose these links here that I don't know if I can carry them over to the new format. Um, I don't see the comments on the new format. So I'm hoping all that will be there if it's just a setting or this or that, but... Uh, I thought also too I'd talk about some of the uh, the pages that I, I frequent quite often. They're here on my um, on my channel. Um, I don't know if users that go to my channel notice this or not, um, or notice even who that they are. Um, very frequently, I frequent uh, Model Man Tom's channel. Um, Model Man Tom has a couple other channels. He has a uh, Modeler's Brand Hobby Supplies, uh, which also is his uh, website for Modeler's Brand uh, <coughs> dot com, ordering lighting products. 
Um, he also has this other page that's uh, Astrometric Builder, uh, which I think he's in kind of in the process of building up and doing more on. Does some posts on that uh, here and there. Uh, I watch Steve Neal. Steve Neal's great. Um, Steve Neal's a special effects guy from way back. Um, watched his videos. Didn't really know too much about him until the Big E story. I uh, started watching it then, and uh, he, his videos are amazing. Uh, really, really cool. He's really, really interesting to watch. Uh, a lot of these other guys, I watch um, a lot of other of these channels a lot. Trekworks, watch Trek uh, Trekworks quite a bit. Uh, Bad Grendels. I'm not sure what Brad Grendel's is. It might be something, but I'm not sure what it is. <laughs> it's an interesting name, anyway. Um, some of these other guys haven't posted in quite some time. Paint Clinic's really cool channel. Um, uh, but uh, a lot of these other channels, some of them haven't posted in a little bit of time. But they're really cool when they do post content. It's great. So... Uh, it's good to see those guys too. Um, I venture out on some occasions and I do some general searches. I find a lot of other uh, tips and stuff on different kinds of formats of model building. Maybe some kind of um, military formats, um, planes, uh, remote control planes, this and that. You see all kinds of things that kind of blend and overlap into the modeling kind of area of things um, so I kind of venture out sometimes and uh, find those also too the old YouTube page features um, the favorites which I'm not sure that will be on the new YouTube format uh, the favorites are great I have a lot of favorite videos, which I'll be uh, sad to lose. I'm not sure if they're on the new format or not. You know, again, I'll ma mail, a lot of these features may be on the new format. You might just have to find it in a setting. Um, I'll be, uh, it'll be a shame to lose a lot of these. I use a lot of these for points of reference. Um, so, to go back to them at any given point and find a video, they say, Oh, I, I remember that video that had this one thing in it, and to go back and look at look at it for a point of reference is a really useful tool, and to to lose that is unfortunate. Um, what else? Uh, I guess not much else. Um, there are some other features that I'm, I'm afraid that I might lose. Um, I don't have playlists, but playlists are nice. Um, there's just some certain features that are gonna that may go away. I'm not sure. Like I said, once I get to the new format, I might check it out, and uh, it may be possible for you to do some of these things in the new format. I haven't got there yet. I haven't made the switch. They did switch me for a little while. I switched back because I'm just not prepared to go yet. Um, but We'll all be making the switch very soon, so, uh, March 7th. So I just wanted to talk a little bit about the history of uh, my page, and, you know, uh, just some of the other uh, featured channels, because uh, I think they feel as if they might get lost um, in the changeover. Um, like I said, uh, I watch a lot of these guys quite a bit. Um some of the new formats here. Um, I watch Trekworks quite a bit. I watch uh, Model Man Tom exclusively. So, I mean, these are just these are channels that, I, like I said, I fear that may get lost to the average, uh, you know, fan or viewer that might be checking out your channel. So, I think that's it for now. I just kind of wanted to feature a little bit about my page. Um, 
before the big change. Um, so like I said, that's probably it for now. Uh, just a little history background on my page and uh, we'll definitely be posting videos in the future once the, uh, the format change comes and we'll get all of it figured out then and uh, get the videos all laid out. And I'll definitely be posting more videos. It'll always be about, uh, like I said, uh, uh, progress updates, um, featured builds of mine, and any kind of information that I can pass along that I feel useful um, that, or helpful, uh, I'll you know want to gladly pass along. So that's it for now.